Thanks for joining my Facebook Live. <laughs> okay, guys. Let me get started here. Thanks for joining my Facebook Live. Today we'll be I am Jackie Styling You from JYL Image and Lifestyle. I am going to talk about the 12 different bathing suit to flaunt your body for the summer. Summer is here. We're either going by the pool or we're going by the beach or we're going by boat. But you got to know your um your swimsuit style to fit your body but first you have to have your hat for protection i just picked up this on when i went to denver cowboy hat it's perfect for the sun bar you have to have a hat for protection to keep the sun off you have to have your towels for my goodie bag which beach bag pool bag boat bag you have to have your towels and you got to have, uh, I don't have my suntan lotion here, but you have to have your suntan lotion. You have to have your sun shades. And I like to have um, water slippers because when we get off the boat, I don't like to feel the sand, it's feel funny on my feet. So I like to put on my water boot, my water slippers when I go to the beach or the sun bar. So that's in my goodie bag. Now, let's talk about, welcome everyone, welcome, welcome. Let's talk about the 12, I have some notes here. The 12 different, hi, Dayan. The 12 different types of bikini to flaunt your body, shape, and style. Come on. Bikini introduced, hi, Lori. Thanks for joining. Bikini was introduced in 1946, has gone through era of change up to date. Nonetheless, the variety have been uh, ever revealing and smaller and smaller and smaller. Um, you might be confused as to what to choose when such occasion knocks on the door and there's no choice of outfit, of course. Uh, bikinis are favorite to flaunt your body figure and summer is coming up so swim time beach time boat time uh, the first one is called the bandue bikini which is a strapless bikini this was the um her oh, perhaps the type that first saw in Sanham Kampu is a bandu across the chest designed for um, sensuous elegant style with a more revealing than usual ones. Let me show you a picture of it. It's called a bandu bikini. That's it. So for the bandu it's skimpy and hourglass shape. The hourglass shape meaning up here is the same size as your lower the hips and your waist is usually 10, um, 10 to 12 inch smaller. That's the hourglass person. So this is best suited for the hourglass. Women not suited for women who have big boobies because when you have big boobies, it will pull this down so you're constantly you know, pulling it up. So it's not suited for women with big booties and this is called the bandu bikini or the strapless bikini the next one is called the multi string bikini which is this one a picture up here this one here what this is can you see it here it has just as the name suggested it's a bikini has a bra with multi straps if you notice you go up there it has a whole bunch of straps here and a whole bunch of straps there 
and it might end up into altar back at the nape of your neck to our style this is suited for somebody with a uh, flat current who loves to show off the shoulder if you have broad nice toned shoulders this is perfect for it right, that's the that is the multi-string bikini then now you have the string bikini which I love I love the string bikini it's um, cast in a magical magical spell by getting into one of these you next in your next swim these have strings to cling to your back and also the waistband is heat up with strings a little bit it's best suited for the hourglass shaped woman who dare to look steamy and is not suited for people with heavy busts so this is the string bikini it has strings here and strings and strings the hourglass uh, person is the same bust measurement is almost the same as her hips but the waist is a little bit smaller like 10 to 12 inches smaller then the next one is the micro bikini which is extremely extremely skimpier than the string bikini this bikini style has bare fabrics enough to cover the down there and down here it's barely very exposed in a variety may have a simple thread to keep the strings covered enough let me show you hi Willie so this is the micro bikini some some of them also comes like just a little string here to cover the nipples but you have to be very daring to wear this is very very small bikini then the other one is called the tanky bikini the tanky bikini is the one most uh, used for all forms of uh, shape with the tank having the straps to the shoulder tanky has a contrast or matching bottom it can be a different color up here or a different color down here and it was designed the tanky bikini was designed by Anne Cole who is considered to be the grandmother of swimwear so let me show you the tanky bikini this is the tanky bikini and this bikini is suited for all body types so anybody can wear this and I um I, I, I can't pronounce that Miss Parks I can't pronounce your name so anybody can wear the tanky bikini it can be of different colors top from the bottom or it can be the same color and it's 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 known by Anne Cole who is the mother of all swim swimwear so this is a tanky bikini then now the next one is the high neck bikini the high neck bikini is this hi girl how you doing is this one this one hi Kevin this one is less revealing than the usual bikini the upper half of the bikini is high neck tube and cover most of the bust with bikini bottoms see there it's a good pick if you swim a lot of sports surfing including it keeps the comfort of it. so this is suited for people who are like uh, like sky not sky diving, surfing swimming it covers you but it's still give some comfort and protection and it's best suited for people that are flat chested so if you have big boobies you can't it's not suited for you people who are flat chested and sport orientated and water sports surfing beach games this is suited for them it's called the eye neck bikini then now the tricky the trinky nini <laughs> and i was like that's the way the trinky nini so this is tricky the trinkinini 
<laughs> is this one. And this in the world of art couture is known as the anchor chip. It has two small saucers. It comes with a bikini bottom and two triangle pieces of fabric covering the breast. Pieces barely cover wearing and quite revealing. Notice that. These days, the swimwear also comes in pastels and a bikini top. So you see, it's best suited for people who are skinny. Skinny. Because if you notice, it has a lot of holes there. So if you are more voluptuous, then um, it will be seeping through the holes. It's not suited for people that are plump women, voluptuous women. Skinny people are suited for this kind of it's called shrinking shrinkinini <laughs> shrinkinini okay so the next one is called the sling bikini so think about a slingshot this is the sling bikini this is also known as a suspender bikini or a slingshot it's a one-piece swimsuit that provides very little coverage, usually in ly lycra. And um, this bikini has straps going from the neck down to the back and along the midriff, keeping both sides and torso bare. So, this bikini is best suited for people that are very well toned. If you, if you notice, uh, if the, the whole sides are out, the, the center part is out. So if you're not well toned, you can, it, it, it's not suited for you. Women that are heavy waistline with a pooch belly stuff, this is not suited for you at all. This is for somebody that is really, really well toned. Okay? Then skirt tikini, skirt tikini, which is this one. This bikini is, is um, provided a good amount of coverage. It covers your legs, it covers the frontal area, it covers the butt area. This has a bikini top and, and skirt at the bottom. To, to date, this is considered one of the top design in swimwear. Um, it's best suited for people who have like a slim waistline, upper shape, people who are narrow here but wider down here, this kind of camouflage, the, if you have a big booty, it's the, upper, the, the pear shapes, not upper shape, the pear shape people, um, this cover that area. If you have uh, thicker legs, it's helped to cover the area. Okay, then uh, number 10 one is called the high-waisted bikini. This bikini is for women that are not fond of revealing their waistline. Um, still wear, but still like to wear bikinis. This has to be, you know, help to cover up any areas around the waist suited for people like who had babies recently and you know still have stretch marks going on and tummy still um not as flat so this helped to camouflage that area it's it's a great pick for people who are post-pregnancy stretch marks and still coming back in shape this is called the high-waisted you still love wearing bikini, but you don't really want to show your waistline area. So this is suited for that, that person. The next one, not the last one, the next one is called the fringe bikini, which is that. And the fringe bikini has fringe attached to the upper bandeau looking type bikini and the bikini bottom to make a whole swimwear. Looks sensual and elegant. It's also good if you want to add volume to your outfit. So if you're like a very slim 
um, um, thin person, the French bikini is best suited for you because it has volume. So if you, you could put fringe on here and or fringe down here, and what it does is give volume to your body, so it's best suited for a very slim or thin person. Apple pear shaped woman, apple are more rounder, pear shape is small at the top and uh, large at the bottom. This is not suited because this gives more fullness and you don't want to add fullness where you're already on the plumper side. So this uh, bikini, which is called the French bikini, is suited for very thin, slim um, purse body type. And the last one is called the flounce bikini. The flounce bikini is this one. And you might want to hit the summer season with one of these ravishing looks. The bikini was flounce alter top and create a beautiful bust line. Shh, stop it. Um, best suited for a woman who has a lot of curves. A lot of curves. Not for apple shape or rectangle. Apple shape meaning you're fuller around in the waist and rounder in the hip not suited for rectangle shape woman which is their rectangles let's, let's pick the rectangle they're square from the top same size in the waist and same size in the hips this is suited for a woman or that or a girl that has a more curvy shape body okay so the majority of uh american i say i think Will, would fall into the let me tell you which one I'm gonna show you the picture which one I think uh, this one the tanky this is suited for all body type and it's not revealing unless you have a trendy personality like I am I go with the bikini string bikini so this is more suited for the majority. It's for all body type. But if you know your fashion personality type and your body type, you can choose whatever bikini you want to flaunt for the summer. I hope this was valuable. If you need, if you, if you have any questions, please let me know. And also, please drink a lot of fluid during the summer. It's hot and you get dehydrated very quickly. If you're gonna be on the beach, or you're gonna be on the, the pool, around the pool, or you're gonna be on the boat, protect yourself and drink a lot of water. Let me see who is here. Uh, I'm asking you guys, please share. You don't know who, the, hi Patrice, hi Quisha, hi Chip, hi Brown, hi Kevin. Hi, thanks for joining. So please share my video and I'm signing off for now. I'm going to take a little swim in my pool. It looks so inviting. It's summer and have a glass of wine and chill. Go have an awesome, awesome, awesome Thursday evening. See you guys later. Thank you. Bye-bye.